Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel. Today I am very excited to share this video because it's a little bit something different than what I normally do. So I really love fall and I do like crafting occasionally as well. So I found three bookish fall craft ideas that are pretty easy to do. If you want some fall decor and you want it to be kind of book related, then these are perfect for you. So I did get all of these from Pinterest and from some amazing blogs. So I do not take credit for coming up with these very creative ideas and I will be leaving the original post to these blogs down below so you can check them out for more information. So let's just get on with what we're going to be crafting today. The first thing is a fall leaf garland, the second is a bookish pumpkin, and the third is a fox book corner. So I'm really excited to share these all with you because I think they're just so fun and cute and perfect to add to your home this fall. First let's start with the fall garland. Now this one's pretty simple. For this craft all you need are some fall leaves. I have a handful here. They were actually on sale at Michael's last week, so I was able to get out a couple bunches of these fall leaves, whatever color, size, whichever, how many you want. It's all up to you. Get an old book you do not want anymore because you're going to be cutting up some pages, and you're going to be cutting the pages into little fall leaves. Now, I have to say I am not crafty, and so I had to trace the fall leaves to get them to look even decently shaped and you're going to want these fall leaves to be slightly smaller than the actual fall leaf because it's going to kind of just sit like so and that's going to create the garland and you need half as many of the book pages as you do the fall leaves because we'll just do every other. Also something that's totally optional, I did add a strand of string lights to my garland and I just brightened it up a little and I really liked the sparkle the lights gave it. So let's get it all together. pumpkin so all you need for this is just like a toilet paper roll and you can cut it down if you want it to be a smaller pumpkin and then from that same book that you don't want anymore you're gonna cut out strips of paper so I have my strips of paper cut out like this and also you will need a hot glue gun I'm not sure if you can get away with using other glue for this but a mini hot glue gun like I have was only a couple dollars and usually there's coupons when you go to a crafting store so I'd recommend you get one anyways because for other craft needs hot glue guns are a must so essentially what we're going to be doing and I will show you further, is we're going to be gluing the paper to the top and the bottom, and then we're gonna go all the way around the tube to create the pumpkin shape. And when we're done, we're just gonna stick some twigs from a yard or whichever in the middle to give it the pumpkin stem. So let's do this craft.
a little more finesse and a little more challenge, but I thought it was really fun as well. And this is the Fox Book Corner. So I have the prototype here for you all. So it just kind of sits in your book, similar to a bookmark, but a little cuter. I'm gonna show you how I created this. I'm not gonna be talking through this portion of the video, so I will be leaving the link to the creator's video so you can watch her kind of go in more detail as she talks through how she makes this cute little box, but I will show you as well. So there we have it. We have some cute little fall additions to our home. I hope you had fun watching this video and I hope you get to making the crafts. If you do end up doing any, definitely let me know. And if you have Instagram, you can always tag me so I can see how yours turned out. Thank you for watching and happy reading. Wake up to the sound of your fleeting heart. 